Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Stardew Valley. I've got a tub of flowers that we got at the, the dance thing, so where do we want this? Eh, maybe just like right there by the fridge? Uh, that seems like a nice place for that. I also want to move that up there. Can't place it on top of a person. Oh, that was me, I guess. Alright. Welcome back to the old farm. The old farmstead, as I call it. <laughs> Which I've never actually called it before. Why do we keep getting this freaking oak resin? But no maple syrup. All I want in life is maple syrup. And like every Canadian ever, all I want in life is maple syrup. <laughs> and according to Dre, Tim Horton's coffee is also apparently a Canadian stereotype I was unaware of. I didn't even know that was a thing. But apparently it is. Okay, we got our strawberries, we got our beans. It's gonna be a good money day. Jeez. We might get up to 50,000 today. I think that'll be a new record for us. So we got some decent strawberries here, too. And they're still producing. Well, there's only three days left in the season, so I kind of doubt the strawberries will produce again by the time uh, the, 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 the summer's here. But it would be nice. Okay, strawberries. Yeah, these crops are going to kind of go down. Uh, we'll water our kale real quick. Man, I just really want the freaking uh, maple syrup. I was watching Bob's Burgers, and he had a good pun about kale. So in that show, every single day they have a different um, burger of the day, and it's always some sort of pun with whatever ingredient it's made out of. And he had one for kale. It wasn't. It was something like uh, using the word kale instead of kill. But I think it was like a movie title. I don't remember. Dang it. I was like literally just watching it before recording. Oh no, that's not true. That was a couple hours ago because it was when I was eating lunch. Out of water. I love how fast it makes it sound. Oh, he's like having a little seizure there. <laughs> Settle down there, buddy. Yeah, so we got the 25th. It's Thursday, so we can't give Leah another gift today, but we can go chat with her. Uh, we'll go hit her up at noon. Actually, we can just go to her house at 10 because she'll be working at. Uh, she'll be working on her little workshop. And I missed a strawberry. Thank God I found it, otherwise I'd have 30 people in the comments yelling at me. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I love when people comment. It makes me so happy. It makes me feel so validated. I don't want to pick our tulip set, but we do want to grab that. Oh, here's actually some we can take this out, get a little hay. And check on the cave. And just stop those trees from growing. You guys know my feeling about trees. Last episode we got stuck in the woods over here and it was driving me crazy because I couldn't freaking get out of them. Get out of the trees! Thank you for providing me every, pretty much literally everything I have, but other than that, you can screw off. Stupid trees, think they're so great. There we go. Uh, wood, we'll just chuck in here. Just kidding, we're gonna put one piece in there. Christ. Oh, Christ, 10 wood, duh. Nope. Okay, you go there. No, oh, don't split it. Oh my god. Fine, we'll just do this. <laughs> no, stop it. Go in there. There you go. Oh, let's go head down to her. Yeah, because we can't give her a gift, right? I'm pretty sure. Uh, well, if we come across something on the way there, maybe we'll hand it to her. Or we'll at least try it. No, it's a... Uh, you can't do it twice a week, so... Must be on Sundays that it resets. But luckily, she lives real close by. So it's pretty easy. People are saying that it's nice because they do help you out on the farm and stuff, like they will uh, water things for you, but I mean, with all these sprinklers, do we really need people to water things? In fact, she'll probably just like water one thing out of a giant crop. Oh, we get a little animation. What are we got going on here? Oh, she's like, who's this random dude busting in my house? Hmm. Come in, come in. Will you paint me like one of your French girls or sculpt me like one of your French girls, Leah? She's working on this sculpture here. Come here, watch this. What you gonna do? Oh man! <laughs> she's got some skills. She's got some real- looks like she's wearing shoulder beds or something. I'm revealing the essence of the wood. Oh god, don't make- don't make a joke. <laughs> don't make a joke. She didn't say wood. <laughs> I'm so mature. Once you get past the outer layers, the true nature starts to show. It's the same with people. I actually prefer the look of- <laughs> I should prefer a look of raw, unadulterated wood. Man, <laughs> it's even labeled as creepy. Uh, it's the same with people. What? Oh yeah, that's absolutely right. Oh, I thought I was getting to a little bit too uh, 
deep or philosophical for her. I first visited this valley as a little girl while on vacation with my parents. I knew I had to come back someday. This place has great artistic potential. Oh, now she's sad. Or she just, just peed a little. Although I have to admit, it's not easy to pay the bills as an artist. Tell me about it, jeez. <gasps> Why don't you have an art show in town? Yeah, let's do that. Or she can sell on the internet. She can do both, right? Interesting. I guess that could set the wheels in motion, making Pelican Town a true art destination. Can I make her in this game? What if no one likes my sculptures? I'd be crushed. Well, they're they're. It looks like a dude bending over with his hand up his own. You know, never mind. Never mind. I'll have to think about it. I believe in you. Well, thanks for stopping by. No problem. Uh, did that count as stalking? Just just to be safe, we're gonna come back in immediately. Watch out there. And I sure for the whole village? That's a bold idea. It is, isn't it? Alright, do you want a bucket? No. I guess you can't give her a gift today. Actually, no, you can't give away those things. Um. Let's see, how are we still uh, good too? Yeah. Nothing around here for fortune. But there we go. There's our daily wooing session, as I call it, for some reason. The amount of salmon berries around here is really, really shut down. I haven't seen them in a while. But we did stock up on them quite a bit. So I think we should be good for a while on salmon berries. And we still have a crap ton. Okay, those are good. Uh, what are our beans? Just try and get another harvest in. So those ones, actually these ones probably won't be ready, but these ones will probably be ready uh, before the season ends. So yeah, we'll just not water those. Actually, we'll probably water them just in case, because I don't think they grow in the summer too, but you never know. Well, actually, you do know I could easily go look it up or something, but what am I, some sort of nerd that reads things? Okay, happy chicken, happy chicken, happy chicken, happy chicken. Got some hay. Hi, hi, hi. Boop. Happy chicken, happy chicken, happy chicken. And thank God I don't have to milk the chickens. Not only does that sound difficult, uh, I'd probably miss because they are smaller targets than the cows. Actually, what I'm saying, they're probably the same size. They only have three eggs? Hmm, I didn't accidentally eat one again, did I? Uh, that'd be pretty embarrassing. Cows! Uh, let's go deal with the happy cows. Happy cow, happy cow, happy cow, happy cow, happy cow, happy cow. Feed! I don't wait. Try to get some hay for you. Give me all that milk. Oh yeah, we're definitely gonna hit 50,000 today. With all those uh, strawberries we got, and all this milk. Actually, we may not hit it, I don't know. Radiant, come on, man. You're a happy cow, right? Why don't you not produce milk? Hmm. That's a weird bug. It makes me walk down like that when I first leave. Like, I'm pressing up on the keyboard. It still makes me walk up, or walk down. Don't know why. Eh, better save the sorry. I'll just keep watering these. I'm excited for summer though, even though the spring, as you know, has my favorite music. The summer tunes aren't bad. There's that one that's like. It actually sounds something like that, but I actually don't remember any summer music. But I wanted you guys to think I was cool. Uh, what do we want to do? I don't know. I'm just, let's just go wander around. Let's get a horseradish. There you go. Ah, oh, forging skills to pay the bills, man. We finally knocked that tree down. And our one smack across its trunk. Linus, let's give Linus a gift. Linus, you want a... I don't know. Want a horseradish? This is a great gift, thank you. No problem, buddy. Seemed like a guy that would be partial to uh, a good horseradish. Oh, we forgot to put the milk in the cheese press. Right, pray to the old Ewok. Hello, Ewok. Um... That's another thing, too. We get that open. I don't know exactly what that does. Let's see. Let's go down. Where are the ghosts? Maybe 25 or something. No, this ghost's not in here. 35? Is this where the ghosts are? 40? Yeah, I think it was these levels which are the ghosts. Uh, because there is a something that has... Dang it. Ah, I used to be guys. Well, we'll get cool out of them, though. One of the bundles. I always click over there for some reason. Um. No, the bulletin board. Pantry. 
Was it like the adventures bundle or something? Huh. Oh wait, we should keep our honey chili. Oh wait, we already kept some of those, okay. So how much more of those do we need? One, two, three. Rampage, okay. Yeah, I haven't come across any of those. Where the heck, what am I thinking of? Crafts room, no. Fish tank, no, we have nothing fish. Adventures bundle, yes, solar essence. Are dropped by ghosts. Pretty sure this is where they were. I really should check it out, but I'll use this as an opportunity to just go get some more stuff. Is there a bat up here? I could use more bat wings. Just kind of fill through this or fill up this day. Just so we don't waste it. I'm tired of wasting days. I'm wasting time. All the time. <laughs> Whatever. Oh jeez. So many monsters. Oh man. These guys do give us some coal, though. The Fleebs, as I call them. Just because they remind me of the Fleebs from Rick and Morty. How it's made. A plumbus. <laughs> the Fleebs are rubbed because they contain all of the Fleeb juice. If you guys don't know what I'm, what I'm saying, because you haven't watched Rick and Morty, go watch it right now. Wait, wait for this video to stop, and then go watch it. Because Rick and Morty is a goddamn amazing show. And we probably are getting season 3 this year. Which is awesome, because I thought we would have to wait until 2017, but we should be able to get it in 2016. I'm so excited. Mr. Poopy Butthole lied to me. The first episode is okay, but it really picks up after that. Uh, a good, good guy that summarizes it is a YouTube channel called Seasoned Reviews, I think. I think it's his name. He does like these crudely drawn, actually they're pretty better than I could draw, like kind of TV show reviews, but they're spoiler free for the most part. I actually think he aims for them to be spoiler free, so that's a good way to get a little sense of a show. Like I've seen his reviews on Rick and Morty and I think Agents of Shield, which was one of the shows that was really bad, and then it was really good, and then it was like mediocre, I guess. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about it right now because it is currently going on. All right, let's head back to. Oh, there was a bat up there. I need to kill bats. Dang it. All right. Stupid bat. I don't know why I'm rushing through these anymore. I'm just used to the mindset of trying to get to the next level as fast as possible. Even though these are all over the old levels, which we can just kind of fly through. Or we can take our time and actually harvest everything we need. Including slime goo. Or slime slime. Is that a little redundant? Slime slime. It's like saying ATM machine. Because I am and... Automated teller machine, or a sensor machine, so you're saying ATM, you're saying automatic, te or automated teller machine machine? I don't know. I try not to think about it. <laughs> oh, we'll take these torches though. Light up our farm with them. Thank you. How about a magnetic ring that just brings everything towards me? It's pretty awesome. Alright, leave the mine. Energy's a little low, it's 7 p.m. It looks pretty light out. Well, I guess it is spring, so the days are going to get longer. Does the game do that, though? Or are the days, in, like, the, not the days, but the daylight. Was it winter? Or is it shorter? Interesting. I don't know if it changes. I didn't actually keep track of that. But it'd be interesting to know now. Because it feels like the sun's setting right about now. It's like 7.30. Yeah, so that seems like summertime. But it, uh, it's different for me, because I'm southwest, the southwestern United States, so... Like, in the summertime, our sun sets at, like, I don't know, 7.30, 8 o'clock. And I know up in, like, the Midwest and stuff, uh, it sets a lot later. Like, I remember it being, like, 9 p.m. in Wisconsin and stuff when I used to visit. To roots, crystal fruit, mayonnaise. Okay, the rest of this we want to keep. Frozen geode. Coal. Those things, how many geode? Like that, that. And stone goes in there. We'll just take that one. Keep these inside. Can we buy like a lamp or something? It's always dark and depressing to my house. And go to bed. I should have put those in the chest. We can do it in the morning. Whatever. Ooh, we will get 50,000. Nice. Okay, oak crescents, 150. Not bad. Hmm, I forgot we had green beans in there too. Got 11,000 overnight. Freaking awesome! Oh man, 26 is spring, you too! Oh boy, why I'm talking like, look at the freaking that the money was shaking! It was even excited, I was like, holy crap! 
Look at all this freaking money. No, sunflowers, you stand there. Nope. Oh my god. Alright, not quite to, what is it, 100 or something for the Adventurer's Bundle? Do, 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 spoiler room, yes. Oh, 99, 10 bat wings. Oh. Yeah, let me need two of those. Dang, I had a Solar Essence at one point, and I'm pretty sure I sold it. <laughs> or gave it as a gift to someone. I don't know. Don't eat the cheese. You stop trying to eat the cheese, you fat little punk. Little turd. Alright, let's uh, deal with the animals. Alright, crops watered, pine tar collected, animals dealt with, the freaking maple syrup, still nothing. Uh, let's check in the cave and then we'll head down to Leah's house, chat with her. <gasps> spice berry, salmon berry. Which we don't actually need, because the spice berry is the one we have. Someone pointed out that it, hey, you have it in your house, you stupid person. They didn't actually say, they're very nice about it. Thank you. I love that, people pointing things out. When uh, they're nice about it. Some people are like, hey, idiot, there's shit in your house. I'm like, oh. But they're like, hey, just let you know. We're just like, hey, there's a spice bear in your house. I just read those entirely different, and I feel like, oh, this is nice. Most of the time I reply, I say, oh, thank you. Sometimes I forget to reply just because, you know, I got comments everywhere, and it's tough to, tough to remember, but I really need to get, do a little better replying. Because one thing people love, they say, oh, it's awesome because you actually reply to people, but it's it's different because my channel is a lot smaller. Okay, so must recount on Sunday. Uh, we won't be able to survive without nature. It's good to remember that. It is. You're so smart and interesting. Let me smell you. No, just kidding. <laughs> uh, people are going to think I'm weird. <laughs> actually, it was pretty funny. I did message my girlfriend on Facebook the other day, uh, a couple before a couple episodes ago, and I... I sent her the the list of the, and pictures of people on Scrap Mechanic or not Scrap Mechanics, <laughs> Stardew Valley that you can marry. It was just in the wiki. And I said, okay, who should I marry? And Leah was one of the ones she suggested. I was like, oh, but what about uh, uh Elliot? He looks like Fabio. And she's like, oh, I didn't realize you were looking at the bachelor section too. I'm like, hey, I'm running a farm. I feel like a big strong man would be useful. <laughs> not to be sexist, but you know what I mean. Okay, there goes there. That goes there. Um, yeah. Everything. Ooh, yes. Perfect. Ah, that's like a, that's like 800 or something right there. Salmon berry jelly. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. I might go ahead and get some more of these bad boys going. I love me some jelly. That's actually what I had for lunch. Peanut butter and jelly. That's what I've had for lunch every day in the past week, I think. It's like back in middle school or something or elementary school. Oh, no. Oh yeah, I do want to go that way, but uh, I wanted to take... Oh, we're going to go donate some stuff to the museum. And we're also going to have... Food. Clint open up some... Stuff for us. Dwarf Skull 3. We already did that one. Bez. Um, uh, wait. Oh, so... Okay. It stops saying Gunther. Uh, like, the Gunther can tell you more once you've donated one. Okay, that's that's decent. Okay. Cool, so yeah, we'll go drop these off to Gunther. He'll tell us some more about them. So then in the future, if we find them, we can just keep them and sell them. And then we'll go have Clint open up our geodes and our frozen tears. And my leg is super itchy right now. What is going on? There was a daffodil back there. I saw it, but I decided to just, you know, keep going. Mainly because I was scratching my face with my other hand. Oh, what's up, Harvey? You, you little turd of a person. I should I should have married Harvey. Just woo him. But like, hey. I hate you, but <laughs> the, who else am I gonna fall in love with? No one but Harvey. Eh, it's really itchy. Okay, uh let's do this first. Hello. Don't scroll. Don't need the museum. Uh, put that there. Put that there. There. I don't know, we'll just start filling the shelves, I guess. I was trying to space them out all nicely, but... New reward, nice. New reward, nice. What do we get? I collect rewards. Standing geode. Awesome. Starfruit seeds. What? That's... Oh, dude. That's cool. Okay. So we can put that in our house. Awesome. That's really cool. Starfruit. I wonder what starfruit is. Hey, buddy. Uh, process geodes. 
How much does he cost? 25? Okay, that's definitely worth it. We'll just do all these. I got some coal. What the hell is that? Looks like a ancient drum. I was gonna say it looks like a donut. Like a jelly donut or something. One piece of stone, boo. Ooh. Ghost crystal. Scary. Oh, now we can just take the rest of these and donate them to... What the hell is that? Petrified slime? <gasps> ooh, ooh. Okay, we're keeping that. That is for one of the bundles. Neptunite clay. <laughs> okay, we're. Oh, we'll donate all of them. Do not donate that. We are keeping that. Yes. Oh, so many new things. Slate. Ooh, copper. Thunder egg. What? Is that what the dinosaur is? Because I heard there's a dinosaur in this game. Uh, Blitz has a dinosaur or something. I'm super jealous. What's that? Granite. Oh, it looked like a newspaper or something. Ah, oh, good. Copper. What is that? Malachite? Malachite? Interesting. Uh, Celestine. Celestine? Earth crystal. Yes, we could just use that to make a mayonnaise machine. Whoa! Jamborite. Is that like a jambroni? Awesome, we got a whole bunch of cool stuff today. Uh, we'll donate what we can to the museum. We'll keep uh, the other stuff. Uh, we'll keep the fire crystal essence crystal thing and sell the other stuff. Done at the museum. Okay, boop. And, oops, that. Bunch of drum. And reward. Petrified slime. Oh, this is petrified slime. Okay, that stuff we've seen before. Granite. There you go. This thing. New reward. Okay, but... Well, we're gonna keep that. We're gonna hang on to that. Collect rewards. Drum block. <gasps> we got a painting! A nine and propelled jade. Oh, dude! Our house is gonna look nice. Freaking lavish. Yeah, let's head back there. And set this stuff up. <laughs> Look at this. this is a drum block. I saw someone actually uh, make a song with one of those. That's pretty cool. Searching these mature. Okay, so these are summer fruit. Awesome. Those be those better be worth a lot. That's, that's so cool. Star fruit. Uh, that goes in there. Mayonnaise. I will just put all this stuff in here for now. Uh, star fruit seeds go in here. This goes in here. Yes, that was one of the things. I think it's the geologist bundle. That's so cool. Oh, let's keep these. Okay, let's put this. Oh, let's actually put this in our room. This thing's cool. Let's put it like right there or something. We got a little painting for bed. Ah, I want center. Oh. That one will center though. Okay, so that'll go there. This one we'll put out here. In front of the window or something. There we go. Cool. Mm. Okay, so we can do this now. Because we have all those. Uh, we, have, we can have all those pretty easily. So now we just need a void or solar essence. Interesting. Uh, the void stuff I'm pretty sure is deeper in the mine. So we might have to go deeper into there. Oh, we gotta water these things. Alright. Uh, but we're gonna call it here, guys. Leave the like if y'all did enjoy this episode of Stardew Valley. I'll see you next time. See ya!